Hey Parasites and welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog and I am out she outside where they're filming Venom 2 right now. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog. And today, and I say today, we've already shot a couple of these today, um, but I, you know, I got up early today. My roommate's already gone to work and I was like, yeah, screw it. Let's do a couple videos. And then, you know, I, I just walked my dog and then let's just go back to bed <laughs> because, uh, you know, I'm still recovering. I'm still tired. I'm having like intense uh, bouts of fatigue and they hit me, you know, throughout the day. And so I figured, you know what? I got the energy now. Let's record a couple of these things and then we'll just go back to bed and I'll wake up and edit them later. And that way you guys have a couple episodes that can post over the weekend while I'm, you know, at work and resting and stuff like that too. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys are liking these, these little shorter episodes. But this one I want to talk about is uh, Naomi Harris. So I noticed that uh, we've seen filming outside with uh, Woody Harrelson. We've seen filming outside with, uh, you know, with obviously with Tom Hardy. I got to meet Tom Hardy. Um, we've seen, you know, detect or who could be Detective Mulligan, maybe Stephen Graham. Uh, I think there was a Scott, uh, Reed Scott was outside in one like photo that we saw earlier. Um, we haven't seen a lot of other characters. Michelle Williams, I haven't seen a ton of her. People said they saw her, you know, maybe running with Eddie at the church, but I didn't see any footage of that. And even people said they saw, they think that's the final battle and they saw Woody and Tom at church, but I never saw Woody there either. I never saw any footage that proved that Woody was on under the rain towers and stuff. So for all I know, that might not be the final battle of the, of the movie. So it's, it's hard to say, but I will say one thing is like, you know, besides Michelle Williams, who we've seen out in public in London while they're filming the movie, but we haven't really seen a lot of stuff of her. Uh, same with Naomi Harris. Like, you know, she's rumored to be in this possibly as Shriek, and yet we've not seen her at all, uh, you know, on set, like, uh, you know, running around, like, you know, loose or anywhere near where they were filming. I haven't seen any pictures of her. And if there is some, please, like, send them to me. Let me know. But I, I've been looking and I haven't seen anything for Naomi Harris. And I started thinking, you know, well, does that mean she, maybe she's not playing Shriek? Uh, because I figured if they're doing the final battle of the movie, yeah, we want the final battle to be Carnage and Venom. But uh, what if, you know, there's a, wouldn't Shriek be there too? Like, wouldn't Shriek be an element of it, of the final battle? Maybe it's two on one versus Eddie. But if so, then wouldn't she have been at the church if the church is the final battle? So maybe the church isn't the final battle. Um, they're doing, I think they've done a couple reshoots. I think they're about wrapped with the, the movie overall. So we'll, maybe we'll talk about that in an upcoming video, but it seems like they might be wrapped. Some of the producers are done. Jake, you know, the stunt double for Tom, he's done, like he's already on the road doing other stuff. Um, he left San Francisco. So it looks like they're mostly wrapped and maybe just doing a couple reshoots because I heard the production has gone flawlessly with this movie I've heard everything has been going really well not unlike the first movie which had a couple issues here and there but for this part uh, for the most part this movie has just been going really well and I, that's great because I think that's a credit to Tom kind of taking the reins after the success of the first movie you pinning down Ke uh, Kelly Marcel writing to write the script getting Andy Serkis involved and then having them all on the same page and like I said I you know I mentioned that earlier I was like the more on the same page that they all are on and the production team and everyone's on the smoother the production will go and that's how it seems to be and that's great to hear but then they got i guess they're reshooting a couple things that they shot in london that maybe didn't work in london so they're just like oh we can shoot those here and i think that's due to like i said london looks nothing like san francisco maybe they shot some things and they're like ah that's that background is too London-y, like it's too iconic London. We got to reshoot this or redo it a different way or put it in a different setting. Maybe we don't want it outside. We'll do it inside at a restaurant in San Francisco or something. So I heard it's just kind of minor reshoots like that, but otherwise they're about wrapped with production and they're going to go full on in editing, which means we'll get trailers soon and all this stuff. So I'm very excited. But with Naomi Harris, I'm kind of curious, like how, like why haven't we seen really anything of her? I imagine if she escapes, you know, prison with, if she's Shriek and she escapes prison she would escape with Cletus, right? Um, unless Cletus goes out and does his own thing and then comes back to bust her out. Maybe that's the case, you know, or or I don't know. Like, I'm kind of curious. So someone asked me the other day, I think it was Eddie's mullet on Twitter, asked me, hey, um, do you think they're going to bring Ashley Kafka, put her in the movie because uh, they just resurrected her in the comic book? Spoiler alert for people reading the comics. I am behind on the comics because I've decided to, you know, actively not read them right now so we can catch up on movie news and, and past, you know, comic book stories uh, and then upcoming Maximum Venom cartoon. So I've to chosen to cut out the current comics for the time being. But uh, in the Ravencroft miniseries that's out by Frank Thierry, it sounds like they brought Ashley Kafka back from the dead, maybe. And that got me thinking, what if 
The reason we haven't seen Naomi Harris is because she only shot interior scenes. So either she's Shriek and she's in jail through the whole movie and she doesn't get busted out till the end. And maybe that's going to set up Maximum Carnage or a future storyline. Or maybe she'll be a member of the Sinister Six. Something like that. Like, who knows? Maybe she just doesn't have a lot to do in this movie, but they're just setting her up for the next movie. Possibly. Or maybe she's playing Dr. Ashley Kafka, who might not have any exterior scenes. Maybe she's just there. She's a psychiatrist for Cletus Cassidy. And then maybe he kills her. You know, we don't know. Like, we don't know what level um, of, you know, role that, you know, Naomi Harris is playing. Because it was only rumored that she was Shriek. But I don't think anything was ever confirmed that she was Shriek. So it got me thinking. So I, I want to hear your thoughts. Like, I hope she plays Shriek. I think she's a good match for Shriek. She's a great actress. I think she's doing an uh, Omaze, uh, you know, a charity event right now where you can uh, win a chance to go see the next James Bond movie with her, which would be awesome. Uh, I'm a big fan of hers ever since uh, 28 Days Later. Um, I've been a big fan of hers. And she's been playing Money Penny and a lot of the Daniel Craig. Uh, James Bond movies and she's been great as Money Penny and so I, yeah I'm a big fan I gotta see that new one she came out with uh, like Black and Blue uh, that cop movie that Sony put out I gotta check that one out because that actually the trailer looked really good on it and like I said I'm a fan of hers so if she's in this movie what do you think? Do you think she's actually going to play Shriek? And if so, how do you explain why we haven't seen in her any shots of her in costume or any shots of her outside? Nothing. Like, none of that has leaked. That's quite impressive. So I'm curious what you think of that. Or do you think maybe she's just playing Dr. Ashley Kafka? Maybe she showed up for like a week of filming. They shot all of her stuff inside. And then she's only in the uh, Ravencroft sequences. Maybe that's the case. Or maybe she's only in Ravencroft, you know, and she's a prisoner as Shriek. You know, maybe she's not Ashley Kafka at all. Either way, I think she'd be great as either role. Um, but I was kind of hoping to see Shriek introduced in this universe and start bringing in non-symbiote threats for Venom to fight. And uh, so I'm kind of hoping that she still is, you know, Shriek that, you know, believing the rumor that came out before. But there's a chance we could be wrong and she could be somebody else. So I want to hear what you think. Now that I've laid out what it could possibly be, let me know your thoughts down below. And as always, we'll continue our conversation down there. Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you in the future. Peace.